this is the first um, cold start of the rocket stove inside the box. Air channel to go down, up, and down, and then up again. So let's have a quick look in here. And see what we've got in here is that's the main rocket engine which is insulated with perlite. And so now I'm just going to light her up and see what happens. You can see it's drawing really nicely. Okay, so it's been exactly 10 minutes since we've actually had the fire burning in, the, in there. Just under 200 degrees there with 10 minutes of twigs. We're probably less than 20 minutes in, but just to see what's happening inside, I'm just going to lift the lid and you can have a look at what's happening inside the engine. As you can see, there's not much smoke already, and you can see the flame spiralling up the tube there. That's our Vortex rocket engine inside the insulated riser tube. Just put this back on. So we just had a look inside, and have a look over here, it's also burning really clean. The sides are radiating heat, so everyone in the room is getting warm, and we're sitting down here, cooking food on top on for about 15 minutes and she's just finished and I'll just quickly check the temperature in the hot spot just there and we've got 250 Celsius and we've got coffee ready to drink just a few small twigs pancakes are about to go on and as you can see no smoke coming out of the top of that chimney. What would you call that? A low heat or a medium heat? Medium, yeah. About a medium heat. With Chetsy the chef, mopping up some sourdough pancakes. How are we going there, Chets? It's burning clean as beautiful and blazingly hot. 